One well-hidden feature of iOS is the built-in dictionary and thesaurus. Here's how it works. To activate the dictionary, you just need to long tap on a word, doesn't matter what app you're using, and on the pop-up menu, press look up. From here, you'll have a choice of different dictionaries, including a thesaurus, British, American, whatever your language your iPad is set to, all of these dictionaries will come up as an option. And you can tap onto any of these to get a more in-depth description of your word. Of course, if you're using the thesaurus, you can get synonyms and other similar words, depending on what you've selected. Now, it might be that you don't want a certain dictionary. For example, I may not have much use for the US dictionary living in Great Britain. You can change this by going to Settings, and then General, and then scrolling down to Dictionary. From here, you can enable or disable whatever dictionaries you like. This can be particularly helpful if you are bilingual or if you're trying to learn a second language, for example, in a French lesson at school. You could enable a French dictionary and look up words that you've typed in pages or notes or whatever it is you're doing.